Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I wanted to share with you my grocery haul from Fred Meyers and also from Winko. I mostly try to eat about 65, 35 plant-based. I do love a good burger, but I definitely like to eat plant-based. So I'm gonna share with you some of the foods that I got uh, on a budget. So let's dive in. I'm gonna share a few of my tips. If you are new here, I would love to have you guys as a subscriber. So I'm gonna show you my grocery haul and share a few of my ideas on how you can save money on your grocery bill. All right, let's 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 get started. All right, so here is my groceries for this about two to three weeks, I would say, if not longer, some of the dried goods. So like I said, I hit up Winko and Fred Meyers, and so I've got some eggs. I've got two containers of 18-pack uh, of eggs. A good trick is actually to get the higher quality or quantity. You will actually save more money. So I got both of these. Uh, I believe it was $3.49 each, so that's a great deal. I eat a lot of kidney beans, a lot of garbanzo beans, just uh, supplementing those with like um, quinoa. I will put it in with eggs sometimes, things like that. So I love the McCafe coffee. I don't know why, but it is so good, so strong. So if you want a good uh, Keurig uh, coffee, McCafe from McDonald's. It's amazing. I get it at Fred Meyers. Uh, that's awesome. So I got lots of greens. I got two containers of the greens. Got some tortillas. Uh, I got some, let's see, canola cooking spray. I actually started getting the larger containers of my almond milk. And I am finding that it's actually cheaper. So, and then you don't have to go back to the grocery store so many times. That is one thing that I am realizing is that I spend more money when I'm like doing multiple grocery shopping trips. So that's why I'm buying more in bulk. Uh, so that, okay, so this didn't quite make it all the way home. Oh my gosh, they're so good, you guys. Um, these are dairy-free, they're gluten-free, plant-based, they're little chocolate cookie crunch. Oh, so good, you guys. I can't even tell you how delish they are. Got a big pack of berries for smoothies. I got some lemons. Uh, I love this bread. I actually got it at Winco. It is a Seattle sourdough. 24 pieces. I thought that was a really um, big pack of bread. Uh, and sourdough is actually healthier for you if you have digestion issues. So that is a good alternative versus um, a lot of that like white and wheat bread. Uh, one of my nutritionists and naturopathic doctors she suggested to uh, dive in and eat sourdough bread. So just a tip and trick. Uh, let's see. I got tons and tons of like some more vegetables. Okay, I have to tell you this story about the grapefruit. I wanted a grapefruit the other day, last week, so bad. I went to a market of choice that's in my neighborhood. One grapefruit, you guys, guess how much? Guess. Three dollars and three cents. I about died. So today I got a huge pack of grapefruits and one grapefruit at Winco. 99 cents. So that's a huge savings, you guys. So definitely, if you can, you know, check out your local stores and like price match. Where is your like stores to get certain foods? If it's meats, if it's bulk foods, stuff like that. So I got some red peppers. I'm going to do a really good, um, like a stuffed pepper dish. So I can't wait. That's going to be on one of my recipes for the, for the week. Uh, a few more vegetables. I eat a lot of vegetables uh, in like salads, dishes, or with smoothies. I did pick up a few household items and pet items in this grocery haul. So I love you guys. If you are one that maybe you've got some stresses going on, you really want to have a better night's sleep, you want to relax, check out Dr. Teal's uh, body wash. It's one that if you're taking a bath, it's really great. Uh, they have a really wonderful lavender lotion. I just love it. It smells so good, you guys. Uh, and then, well, 
you know, those items, um, which I do go all organic with. Uh, they're a little more expensive, but it's worth it. And then I am in a wedding this coming weekend, and so I did get some of the Jergens Firming Lotion, Tanning Lotion. It's one of the better ones I like. It's uh, It smells pretty decent, but uh, I don't know. Spring, summer's coming around, guys. You know, those arms need a little tanning. The legs need a little tanning. So I got that. So pet supplies i did get a big container cat litter that would last me easily about a month or so uh actually if you can tell zoe is back there hey zoe hi are you hiding there's my girl hi that's zoe and then i did get some uh, cat food. So I recently got her a different kind of cat food and she was getting really sick. I She's never been one to um, like get sick with different foods. And so I, I when I changed up, I'm like, okay, back to the regular. So it is a high protein sweet salmon and sweet potato. It's grain free. Uh, a little bit more of the natural type cat food. Not a bad price. I got it at Fred Meyers. I think it was like less than $8. So I feel like for what I'm getting, it's a pretty decent price. So anyways, guys, that is my grocery haul. Like I said, I do have, um, a, you know, some a big turkey uh, that I will cook probably in the next couple of days. I will supplement with a little bit more of plant-based um, meats that I did get at uh, Grocery Outlet. If you are looking for good prices on meat, Grocery Outlet. I will share that in just a sec, my fridge. One second. So this is my freezer. So this uh, turkey, I'm gonna defrost that probably. I'll pull it out tomorrow. I'll be home for quite a few days. I'm on a mini little you know, away from work. So I will definitely cook that. Uh, I've got some plant-based meats I will cook up. Um, but I was really impressed in regards to the, to the prices at um, Grocery Outlet on just meats in general. Uh, they have pretty good uh, foods for on a budget. I've got tons of salmon that I can cook up. Uh, and then I've just got a few more plant-based products and then that will be my meat if I do eat like plant-based or fish or some turkey like I said I am probably 65 35 plant-based um just still playing with it so all right so that is my groceries so what did I spend I spent uh 84 dollars at Winko and a little over $62 at Fred Meyers. So I feel like for $140, this is a pretty good grocery haul. I mean, pet items, some, you know, basic items for, you know, the bathroom and self-care. And then just coffee. I mean, my goodness, 12 coffees. This was $7.99, you guys. One coffee is at starbucks is what almost six dollars now so that's why i definitely created my coffee cart station if you haven't checked out that video i'll make sure to link that down below so this is kind of my grocery haul for the next couple weeks all right that's the grocery haul uh hopefully it was helpful some few tips a few products that i like to use if you are plant-based a few ideas for you guys uh and some practical ways to save money and be sure to set a budget if you can grocery haul it and buy in bulk if you can that definitely cuts back on those multiple trips to the store that you end up spending more money use a grocery list clean out your freezer your refrigerator do an inventory those are just a few of the things that helps me to save money on groceries so anyways guys glad to have you in this uh, video if you are new here again I would love to have you guys as a subscriber check me out over on Instagram. I'll put the links down below and we will see you in the next video. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.